we meet again. So, you're looking at the title and you're like, what? What's going on? Um, yeah, so today we might be shaving my head, we might be bobbing my hair, we might be just trimming it, but we'll see. Um, so let me run you through the plan real quick. Okay, so first, I'm gonna take this down, I'm gonna trim it. Then we're gonna attempt to bleach it because I wanna be blonde, okay? If it gets really damaged, we're gonna bob it. We're gonna cut it right here. We're gonna say, phew. And if it's still as damaged as shit that short, or if I hate the bob, we're shaving my head. If it turns out bad, like I don't really care because I'll just be shaving my head, you know? So let me show you what we have in front of us today. We have foils. We have bleach, obviously. We have 30 volume developer. We have bowls label gloves and we have scissors these are dog grooming scissors but they work on my hair just the same first we're gonna put this down and trim it my hair is also very dirty because i don't want the bleach to burn my scalp so let's begin okay we have the first trim sectioned out so we're just gonna trim above these little hair ties this is gonna be the easy part and thank you to my Pupwell grooming shares. All right, there's a mirror right here, so I'm looking right here. Oh, that went down, so we're just gonna guess on that one. <laughs> and there we go. First trim, it obviously doesn't look good right now. I'm gonna fix it up a little bit, and I will get back to you. Look at all those dead ends. Lovely. Hello. I'm back. I sectioned my hair and I made the bleach. So it's time to get rolling. It's time to section. It's time to bleach. That's a beautiful color right now. See, I have so much hair and it makes me not want to use the foils. It makes me want to just do this. But I know that's probably not the smart thing to do. But do I want to do the smart thing? Do I care enough? I don't think I do. I might just use my hands. Sorry, Brad. Um, because I have foils. But they're also... Um, that'd be a lot of foils. You know? You might just use my fingers. Sorry, everyone. We're gonna put on the gloves. And we're gonna take a drink of water and we're gonna pray to God. Alright. Let's roll. Let's try one foil and see how it works out. Yeah, no. It's not happening. Sorry. Mm-mm. Babe, could you come roll my sleeves up? Damn. Just so everyone knows, Izzy is fully supportive in me shaving my head. She wants me to. I don't have to worry about her breaking up with me or anything if I pull up Britney Spears. So, hee <laughs> hee. So fun. It's already starting to light it. It's already starting to lighten. Jeez. So that's a good sign. And like I said, I've never went into bleaching my hair with the mindset of, I don't really care if it falls off because I've always obviously wanted to keep my hair. But then after lots of thought, I was like, but it would be so fun to say, I shaved my head. So... It's kind of cool that I'm going into this being like, I don't really care. I mean, I obviously would love if it turned out. I'm not going to lie to you. But it's okay if it doesn't type deal. And I feel like the only thing that's holding me back from just shaving my head right now is the grow out process. Because I've heard that that sucks so bad. But my hair does grow fast. We're just going where the wind takes us okay if it happens it happens it's okay i'll do it so you guys don't have to and then i'll share how long it takes to grow out and the grow out process and all the awkward stages and everything just in case you guys want to do it too because like i said it would be fun to say oh, i shaved my head and i already have an undercut which obviously is not the same thing as a shaved head, but it gives me a little snippet 
of what it could be. Babe, is my back, my back's not covered, right? No, no. Do I care? Not really. Next section. And also, I've talked to a lot of girls who have shaved their head. And they have all said that it was the best decision that they ever made, that it was freeing, that their hair is healthy, because the main reason why I want to do it is because my hair is so dead. That's my, I don't think I ever said that. That's my main reason. My hair is like breaking off an inch from my root. So my hair is very dead. So that would be the main reason that I'm doing this. And you know what? It might happen. But I have talked about shaving my head for probably a year now. So this isn't just like a spur of the moment decision. This isn't like a, mm, let's be manic and shave our head, no. It's been a long process of yes and no and like worrying about if I'll be ugly or not, basically. But Izzy does a very good job reminding me that I could not be ugly even if I tried. That's nice that she does that. <laughs> and hypes me up so that I believe that I'm pretty even if I don't have hair type deal. That's good. So I really suggest if you want to shave your head to have a very supportive partner because that helps a lot with the what if I look ugly or what if my partner won't love me anymore because I don't have hair. Well, get a better partner. That's what I have to say about it. And like she's gonna help me do my roots and she's gonna assist the process. And I might get to help shave it. I'm not, I'm recording here. And I might not get to help shave it. Yeah, I told her that she could shave some of it if I end up shaving it. She's very excited about that possibility. I'm excited to like rub it if I end up shaving it. I know, I'm so excited to rub your little bald head. I know, <laughs> how fun would that be? I love that feeling of like a buzz cut. Cause like whenever Bay had one, I always went like this. Yeah, or like my undercut. You like yeah. touching it when I first got it. And it's just gonna be my whole head this time. I also have a frick ton of hair. So this bleaching process always takes an absurd amount of time, which is so fun. I don't know, I shouldn't have bought foils. <laughs> and they yeah, were like, like 20 bucks. Yeah, the foils itself were like 20 bucks. But I thought I was gonna be professional, but I should have known that that's not gonna happen. This is not a professional channel. Brad, how's my sectioning? How is my sectioning? How is my lathering? Well, bleach doesn't lather, but you know what I mean. Like, am I putting enough on? Tell me the tea. I feel like this is gonna be a very freeing thing for me. I don't know, I'm excited either way. If it turns out, if it doesn't. Cause either way I'm gonna have a drastic outcome. Oh, there's a horse outside. I live in a very small town. So there are literally Amish people riding in their horse carriages. But I'm gonna finish the bleaching. I will get back to you because this clip is obviously getting very long. I will check back in when my whole head is bleached. See you soon, besties. Can you come turn this off? Yeah. Hello. So this is where we're ending for right now. We're gonna see how this goes. I'm gonna do my roots when the timer gets to like 10 minutes. I'm leaving this in for 45 minutes and then we're gonna wash it out. <sighs> That's what it looks like. Looking pretty promising. It's processing and lifting pretty nicely if I do say so myself, but I might just be stupid. My skin is burning, so I'm gonna go rinse it off my skin. And I'll get back to you in 45 minutes. Hello. I have about 15 minutes left on my timer. So I'm gonna start doing my roots now. My gloves are wet, because I only have one pair. <laughs> so I have to keep rinsing them off. So I'm gonna mix my bleach now. I am very happy that I got a tub of bleach, because last time I bleached my hair, I did indeed run out of bleach and that was not good. So Izzy is gonna come in and help me with the back of my head, obviously. As of right now, I'm just gonna do what I can. Ooh, it's really blonde.
I'll report back when I'm done with my roots. I'm not talking because I'm stressed out. <laughs> we just set a timer for another 10 minutes. This is the situation. I look like Maleficent. We're gonna wait, I'm gonna wash it out. I already found some breakage while I was doing my roots. Um, <laughs> it's actually right here, you can see it. Uh oh baby, broke off. Don't know where the rest of her went. See ya in 10 minutes, baby. All right, we're gonna let it loose. We're gonna let it down. I wanna see how it goes. I don't think it's gonna look good. I'm gonna tell you that right now. Cause I got a little, like I said, I got a little glimpse. And um, it did not look good. <laughs> so, here we go. This is the moment of truth for everyone. You're not even looking. <gasps> I was, no, I was clicking on be real cause I was gonna do be real while you do it. Okay. Here we go, ladies and gents. I missed a lot of spots. There's literally, you see the strand right here? It's just brown. I don't know how I missed that. <gasps> what? Oh my God. <gasps> how did this happen? How did it happen? How did I miss that many spots? That like doesn't make sense. I feel like I should bleach it. Cause I can do it good and right. You do it kind of messy. Can you give me my comb from the bathroom? Guys, I don't know what to say. I really don't know what to say. I'm very embarrassed right now. Okay. I'm very embarrassed. Brad Mondo, if you're watching this, can you tell me where the frick I went wrong? Where did I go wrong? Because I thought I did a pretty good job. This is like the best bleaching application I've ever done. Oh, it's coming out. It also feels like it's never gonna dry. Mm. <laughs> Let me, let me take a moment to compose myself. I'll be back. I'm gonna show Izzy this and show you her reaction. Oh my God, it feels terrible. It feels terrible. I'm gonna have to shave it, I think. I literally think I'm gonna have to shave it off. I'm gonna show you how much hair I just lost. Oh no, baby. You also got packages. Great. Okay, get in the frame. Okay, hold on, let me set this down. Close your eyes. Open. You're lying. <laughs> it feels terrible. Oh, oh no, no, no. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. Let me take a moment to compose myself again. Okay, I'm gonna be real honest. I don't think there's any saving this. We're gonna try. I just sectioned it off again. We're gonna chop all this off. Oh my god, that one. Huh? That one chair? Yeah. Where are my scissors? Here we go again. Do you see it? Like. Holy shit, they're so short. I've never seen it that short. I know. Just fucking sh <laughs> This is the situation. Oh my gosh. That we are in right now. Terrible. <gasps> okay. Now I'm gonna assess. Okay, here's the game plan. I'm gonna let it dry. I'm gonna see what we're working with, damage-wise. It's coming off a lot more orange on camera than it is in person. I don't even know what it is in person, it's a lot. But I thinned out the ends. This is the amount of hair that is gone now. But I'm gonna try to clean this up because it's a lot and I'm, get, I'm getting hair everywhere. So I'll come back when this is dry, if it ever dries. We're gonna shave it, like, no, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna assess, yeah, we're gonna assess when it dries. So we meet again. Okay, so. <laughs> hey girl. <laughs> Jump scare. So my hair is obviously very orange and it is still so unhealthy. Like, it's so dry, it feels like straw, it's disgusting. So we've made the executive decision to shave it off. I look terrible. <laughs> we're just gonna do some chops so that we can so it's not this long, because the razor would probably get stuck. We gotta do some chops together. <laughs> you have a different hair size, you gotta have fun with it before you shave it. What do I do? I don't know. Oh my god, it gets in my ear. <laughs> I don't even know, like, I I wouldn't know what hairstyles to try out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you 
Your hair is so dead. There was no coming back, like, from this. Like, there was no coming back from how dead my hair was. And I have so much hair, a ridiculous amount of hair. Ooh, my ear is cold already. <laughs> so we're using a 16 guard to start because I don't know how short to go because obviously I've never done this before. So are you just gonna go down the middle? <gasps> did you get anything? Did I? Yeah, you did. <gasps> It's that long? That's too long, right? You want me to do it since I'm a barber? No, I'm gonna go right down the middle, okay? Yeah. Well, why don't we do it with this, and then if it's too long, do it afterwards, it do it over. Okay. We're being smart. Well, look at my head. We're getting places. Look at my tail. Are you gonna keep it like that? No. That's dark as shit. We didn't even get that spot. I know. It's so dark back here. That's so weird. We're going a little bit shorter. I am so itchy. <laughs> body hello so this is it this is the final product um <laughs> i did my makeup and everything so that i could like get the full effect <laughs> it's only the second day so i don't really think i've realized what i did yet <laughs> but it is really cool to like touch and rub and i'm just excited for my hair to finally be healthy again like i made a pact to myself that when it grows back i'm only letting hairdressers touch it so all the videos on my channel of me dyeing my own hair this is now the end of that era obviously i have no hair to dye anymore this is it <laughs> um i think i like it but like i said i might still be in shock we're just still trying to wrap our head around the fact that i actually did it and that i didn't chicken out and all the years of me joking about it has finally come true <laughs> i hope you guys like this video i'm gonna start posting more because i'm in school again so i'm gonna film like college day of my life and stuff like that be sure to like share comment subscribe the whole nine yards because it really helps out my channel let me know what videos you want to see in the future and i hope you guys like my hair because it's gonna be like this for a very long time but I'm also gonna film like through every awkward stage and all that just so you guys know like the reality you know because you don't really see like the weird grow out spots with other people but I will be I obviously document my life so you will see that from me but I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you next Sunday bye